Hey, what's up, y'all? Daquan here with DaquanBowens.com, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a free lesson from my course, Understanding and Mastering Drop Twos. This uh, exercise that I'm going to show you requires triads and your knowledge of the circle of fourths. Okay, so first we're going to uh, play the triads of the exercise. It's going to be a one-four chord progression, but we're going to follow the circle of fourths. Okay, so. We're gonna start on C and second inversion, right? And we're gonna to move to uh, root position, right? And then we're gonna to go to the four of C, which is F, right? And then we're gonna move that to root position. And then we're gonna we're gonna do that following the circle of fifths, but moving counterclockwise, which moves in fourths. Okay. So here's the exercise. Uh, let's start lower. This exercise is a really great way to help you see the keyboard, help you understand the circle of fifths and to learn all your keys and to learn how to do this move in all your keys. All right. So depending on your the amount of notes you have in your keyboard, it will be very difficult. Like right now I have a 76 note keyboard and uh, so I, I, I don't have enough keys to really do it from the lowest note always to the highest note, so I have to pivot in certain areas. For me, I pivoted on F sharp, which is halfway through the circle of fifths. Okay, so I'll show you. The next one is, was F, and then the next one is B flat. The next one is E flat. The next one is A flat. The next one is uh, uh, D flat. The next one is G flat or F sharp, so I moved down. So I went to C flat or B, to E, to A, then I pivoted down to D, to G, and to C, okay? So for each chord, I, I flam from the two to the three, okay? So for that first chord, which is uh, the second inversion, and then I invert to the root position or the... Uh, yeah, the root position triad, but first inversion, drop two chord, okay? So, and I do that on every uh, chord, okay? So just keep that in mind. But here's a different way you can do it, like this. Whoop. did it in every key. All right, so let's try to put this in a song. Uh, let's walk down the scale of the key of C. Here we go. Just something simple, just like that. To the five. Hope you guys enjoyed this lesson make sure you like subscribe share and i'll see you guys in the next video and for my people on the course i'll see you in the next lecture